made it my top priority today to ensure that I perform my civic duty and ensure that I inspect the voters' role. SEC is conducting a voters' role inspection exercise which ends on the 31st of May. Now I started off in Gun Hill at the Hello Road tent and when I got there I asked the SEC officials how the process works and they told me that you have to go to the polling station that you're going to be voting at. It would seem that they only have a polling station based voters' roles. They don't have constituency-wide or nationwide voters' roles. So what this means is if I had inspected the voters role that is at Gun Hill, one at Avondale or Hellenic Primary School or somewhere else in the constituency, I would not have found my name there. I have to go to the uh, inspection centre or the polling station where I'm going to vote. Uh, and I asked them, how do I find out my polling station? They asked me to dial star 265 hash. Now I know this uh, star 265 hash has been giving people a lot of problems, but today it seems to be working and for me it worked. I established that I'm going to be voting at Groombridge Primary School, so I immediately came here. I approach the ZEC officials, all they require is a copy of your national ID. I check the role, my name and my details are there and they're accurate. Uh, they then, I then asked them, so what happens if there's a mistake or an error in the role? They indicated that there's an affidavit in a form that you fill in uh, to ensure that it's rectified. What this means is that if you go to a polling station you're not meant to be uh, voting at, you won't find your name in the role, you have to go to your polling station. So what this means, and we demand this from ZEC, is that information about people's polling stations has to be made available. The USSD system has to be immediately updated so, so that especially new voters, transferred voters can all find out which polling station they have to go to conduct uh, the inspection process. And more importantly, we demand from ZEC a copy of the electronic voters' role and uh, that that electronic voters' role is independently audited. This is the only way uh, we can ensure that the election and the vote will be verified. And we continue to call upon citizens. Voting works, but we have to ensure that we defend that vote. And a key part of defending the vote is participating in this inspection process, which is a key feature of the Defend the Vote campaign. Let's make sure we defend big so that we win big this year.